Hello and welcome back to Lies of P. And uh, last episode we went through the big opera house a little bit. Uh, unlocked one fast uh, shortcut. And uh, we're going to be going back there in a second. Explore some more of it. I have a feeling that the boss of that area is going to be the opera singer that we've been hearing about. I've got another... Uh, quartz. So let's stick this in there. Let's see, anything I want from... From this section, reduce item prices. No, I don't care about that. Legion magazines. I don't really use my Legion arm very much. I guess I probably should. It just takes a long time to charge up. Uh, this stuff, increase max amount of gold fruit on the tree, don't need it at all. I can just wait a little bit longer and get more fruit and pick it up in a timely manner and that'd be fine. Uh, eliminate or increase ergo upon eliminating an enemy. Did I get the first one? Yeah, I did. Level one. Uh, maybe I would get that. Let's see, what's in abilities? Quick wish stone use. That would actually be useful. It's not something I use often, but in a boss fight, I need that. Restore durability of inactive equipped weapons. I only equip one weapon at a time, so that's not useful. Lowers durability consumption when weight increases. That's kind of nice. Lower stamina consumption of all actions when pulse cells are discharged. Also nice. A lot of these are really only useful in boss fights like this one. I mean, it would be useful outside of a boss fight, but um, usually when all my cells are discharged, that's in a boss fight. Let's see, survival. Oh, I can't, I can't pick another from survival. It's gotta be ability or item. I'm gonna do use wish stone quickly. There we go. And uh, we got enhanced pulse cell recovery too. So our pulse cells recover faster, that'll be useful. Enhance Pulse Cell Recovery. Hmm. Yeah, so... That should help quite a bit. Having my pulse cells uh, fill up quicker means more healing and uh, all that stuff. Now, let's try this new weapon I got. Exploding pickaxe blade. Oh, it's a large blunt weapon. Scales with motivity. Nice. And uh, it's, be <laughs> it's beautiful. Okay, it's not super slow. I like that. I don't like the swing. Swing path there. I would prefer like side to side, but that's okay. This is... Uh, it's kind of at an angle. Ah, oh, it's okay. Okay, what about... 
Bom. Oh, that lights it on fire. Oh, I like that. Then the next, uh, next attacks after that are, um, flaming. And uh, I think that reduces stamina usage. For the next few attacks. Yeah, it reduces stamina usage by about a third. It looks like. That's my secondary uh, skill. Flame Strike and Conserve Energy. Um, yeah. I like it, I think. It weighs a little bit less than my current weapon. I know my way of It takes hidden moonstones to upgrade it. Why not? I've got plenty. Okay, now how does it compare with the Holy Sword, physical attack, 232, 211, um, yeah, I still can't upgrade this anymore. Okay, uh, while I like it, I don't think I'm going to use it. I just like the Holy Sword a lot. So I'm going to stick with that right now. Uh, can I modify this Legion Arm? Yes, I can. It takes two Legion Caliber. I have two. Yeah, the problem on this, I, I don't really need this. I might want to save my calibers for another arm if I can make another one. I think I will because uh, I don't think this one is going to increase my damage output very much at all. Maybe a little bit. And the overcharge, definitely not going to use... I mean, look how long it takes to charge that. When am I going to get a chance to ever do that? I'll never have a chance to just stand there and an opportunity to just stand there and charge for like four or five seconds. I mean, I guess if a boss is staggered, but then wouldn't I just do a critical strike? I don't know. Maybe if I combine it with a, like a P organ ability that, or something that makes my, um, arm charge faster. Okay, thankfully, I don't have to kill all the little girls again. I opened up a shortcut. Now, there's stuff down there. I saw something... Yeah, right there. 
So I gotta go down there, but let's try to get across first. Nothing gonna pop out of the door at me. Oh, boss. Oh, that's the uh, Trinity door. Let's go down there. Don't have the key yet. Called little girls. Oh, they tore this person up. Incredible Vanini Collection. Can expand Pulsanella's shop. Oh, nice. More items for sale. I love it. Oh, uh, boss fight, you say? Um, I was thinking maybe I should level up. I don't know if it really matters. I can easily get my souls back if I die. Well, let's... Take care of this guy first. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. It runs. God, dead end. I tried to get a, tried to be clever and get a perfect dodge or get perfect block. Okay, I think this is going to lead somewhere where I haven't been yet. Hey, come back here. Where are you going? Thankfully, she doesn't seem to have a projectile attack. Dead end. 
books stacked in an unnatural way. A goblet. Wow. That's like a... Yeah, that's a golden... Chalice right there. Notes from an experiment. The test subject's body is better than expected. It's ergo coordination, physical sensitivity, and modification adaptability figures. All exceed expectations. Oh boy, they're talking about the boss. Couldn't ask for a better result. All that's left is to make a decision. I won't be able to undo my crime. Oh, they made the decision. I don't regret it. I've come too far for regret. I'm ready to become a god or a, or, or a devil. I just hope that the owner of the body finds peace through this revenge. Perhaps this prayer is a, rem a remnant of my last bit of humanity. What did you do? You monster. Um. Nope. How do I get on that? Oh. Okay, curious where this leads. Because upstairs. Oh god. Upstairs is the boss fight. Haha, shortcut. Where is this though? Is this outside? Outside the. Um, right, right outside the front of the opera house? Yeah, it is. Okay. Anything else down here? No. Okay. I think it's time we fight the boss. Now I'm gonna have to uh, recharge my flasks. There we go. And um, do I have a Electric grindstone. Yes, I do. Wait a minute. No. This is going to be... Not a puppet. I think. I think this is going to be... The opera singer. So I want to use fire. I think. I don't know for sure. But that's what I suspect. It's gonna be her. Huh? Okay, here we go. My fire doesn't go out before the cutscene ends. Hey, we're watching a play.
Doing a little heart surgery. Are you the boss? I thought you'd be bigger. And more... Organic. Oh, I want that heart. Oh. Well. Definitely bigger and nice hat. Don't piss that thing off. Oh, look what you did. Okay, right away, I'm gonna use my box. Oh yeah, that was quick. Okay, friend, help. Ow. King of Puppets. Miss me. He's going nuts. What are you doing? Alright, where's the safe zone for that one? Hey, my, um, my friend there's doing pretty good. Really holding his own. Ah, uh, there we go. Gotcha. I'm sure you have a second phase. Yeah, I know you're angry. And he lost his hat. There he is. Or she? Is that the opera singer? Got a scythe. Beautiful. I hope my specter's still there. Yep. Oh, nice. Kicking butt. Nah, I can't hit him. Oh, I, I gotta get behind him to do it. Oh, it's too late. No, I got it. I got it. I got it. Keep it. Keep whacking him. Oh boy. Ha, <laughs> missed me.
Oh boy. Now that one would have been a tough fight. Solo for sure. Incredible. You Goodbye. Thank king. you. I gotta think the puppets will have changed too, right? I mean, there's only one way to find out. Maybe. Let's go backstage. King of puppets. Okay, I thought that would have been the opera singer. Ow, I'm overheating. Um, nothing back there, no. Well, it was a good show. That was a cool design. On that boss. Really well done. Okay, let's uh, check this out. What's back here? The opera house is on fire. That should be concerning. Is that Geppetto? I'm glad you're safe. I was so scared I would lose my precious son. It's risky for me just being out here. Fortunately, you didn't need my help. I'm no. so proud that I got to see my son defeat the king. Hopefully the lesser puppets will die down soon. Now that the king is dead, the puppets have no leader, no direction. But the curse of the petrification disease still lingers. Yeah, what about it's that? Tough. But I know where you should go now. The Grand Exhibition. Rumors say the alchemists there have developed a cure. As a man of invention, I'm skeptical of the alchemists, both their science and their motives. But they may be the city's last hope. Won't you help me, son? Take if this. I have to. You'll find it most useful. If it will help Antonia and the others, it's worth exploring. Go to the Grand Exhibition and see what you can find. Okay, that's my next destination. The maximum number of pull cells has increased. Yeah, I have eight now instead of seven. Awesome. That one puppet could control so many others. That's a memorable feat indeed. Unlike a real king, the puppet left no heir. The remaining puppets are leaderless, and we can reclaim the city. But it's still a city beset by the petrification disease. Seek a cure from the alchemists at the Grand Exhibition. The one, unlike a... But it's still a city beset... Okay. Uh, yeah. Well, I don't really know how the puppet... The king of puppets was uh, controlling the other puppets. Uh, that was never really explained how all this works uh but yeah we'll see if these puppets have changed or if they're still hostile puppets or not i guess there are there's some down there well he said they'll die out soon so maybe not just yet but, uh, yeah, we still have the issue of the petrification disease. So that is most definitely... Something we'll have to take care of. What is this music coming from? Just someone playing random music. That's a dog with a... Saw blade strapped to its head. That makes sense. What's going on? All these puppets look 
utterly down, depressed even. Do that they? seems weird. That's weird, right? Uh, I, kinda. I mean, they, yeah, I guess. Looks like they're crying. This guy's banging it against the wall. But... He's banging this uh, puppet show festival. Yeah, he is not happy. Strong miss. Ah. Well, they're still smiling. That's good. They're king dead. They they seem lost. Then again, maybe maybe they're warning him. Whatever's happening. It's like they can't tell their elbow joints from their tail sockets. I'm not even sure they can function without the king to guide them. Yeah, maybe they'll all just disappear. I mean, they don't have control of the workshop anymore, so they can't make anymore. Okay, let's keep going here until we find a stargazer. Oh, don't tell me I can't break these boxes. Yeah, they're all sad. The puppets are sad. You gonna come down on me? Oh. Oh. one of these, the headless ones. Well, at least they're predictable. I got almost a thousand ergo from them. From that one. Alright, what do we get? Quartz? Clock sword blade, clock sword handle. Okay, another sword for me to check out. Uh, it's a sword type, so like a short sword. Fast, less damage. That looks uh, a bit ridiculous. Uh, it's fast, all right. Scales with um, motivity and technique. Yeah, the weapons in this game are kind of ridiculous. My sword is so... Just over-the-top fancy engravings. I love it. And it's got these... Um, Klingon style blades on the, the sides there. 
I don't know. I'm not a fan of Star Trek, but... I think the Klingons had some blades that look like that. Another dog with a saw attached to its head. That had to be designed by a bot, or by by the puppets. Yeah, I'm wondering if they designed their own puppets and then produced them from the warehouse when they took it over. Can't think of a reason why you'd make a dog with a saw attached to its head other than because it's fun. But I don't see any practical use for it. Alright, I came from there. Just looking around, make sure I didn't miss anything. Oh, there is... Oh, I thought that was a ramp. Ah, oh, well. Can't go up there. Lorenzini Arcade. Hey, it's unlocked. Nothing up there. We should be finding a stargazer pretty soon. Okay, we're fighting more of these guys. That means uh, fire or acid. I think acid might work against these guys best, but I don't. I don't know for sure. And then fire for the... What are you? Fire for the humans. These guys are like... Infected humans, so I think they're treated... Differently. Can I break these chairs? I can't. Why can't I break those chairs? Ah, uh, there we go. There's a stargazer. Not getting through there. Alright, let's go back. To the mansion. Yeah, we can see there at the bottom. Hotel Crown. Everybody wants to talk to me. Uh, where's the note left at the counter? Yeah, where's that guy? There's something I want to tell you, Geppetto's puppet. Uh, there's something I want to tell you, Geppetto's puppet. Please come to the hotel garden on the way to Elysian Boulevard. Okay, so we killed the puppet king and then he... left. You okay, lady? You've been staring at this thing for hours and hours. I know. I'll find a cure. 
at you. Come closer, won't you? Uh -huh. When you reach a certain age, it's a comfort to reflect on old memories. That's a portrait of me when I was young. <laughs> I was so feisty, so fearless back then. I loved the world, and the world loved me back. The passion of those days is long gone, but I still dream of those memories. I'm curious what your young eyes see. Is there any resemblance between me and that portrait? Do I still have There's nothing left. Of course, I see no... No change. A gray hair or two here and there. Memories are still vivid in my mind. Time. Other than that, time and the memories that fill it are looks the same. I hope you're making some good memories of your own. It may be a comfort to you someday. The air goes whispering. Ah, it happened again. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know what that means. People have no ideas. Thanks for keeping. Okay, well we got that interaction out of the way. Oh, we can make a new weapon. A great weapon calls for a great one. A uh, burnt white king's ergo. Yeah, we can get that Puppet Ripper, which looks awesome. Oh, it looks so awesome. I kind of want the amulet, though. All Legion Arms ability tier plus one. I mean, I don't use the Legion Arm that much, but I, I want to try start to start using it more. But I also love the the weapon. I mean, I don't think I would use it, but it looks amazing. Okay, I'll decide later which one I want. I can only get one. And now, let's talk to Geppetto. Ah, I'm glad you're here, my son. Have you seen that painting? That one? Yeah. My eyes, it's almost as if something is growing out of the portrait. Oh yeah, there's a like a I remember commissioning that piece from an artist. A black stain on it. Gray. Like all artists, he was eccentric. He claimed that a painting could harbor a living soul. Yeah, we read about him. How can that happen? Just like the fairy tale. Forgive a foolish man his ramblings. Perhaps the seed of its growth was there all along. I know you're curious, so see for yourself. I have my work to keep me busy. You don't remember much. Ask me about... Grand Exhibition. Let's talk to him. We plan to reveal our new automated puppet technology at the Grand Exhibition. If it hadn't been cancelled, it would have shocked the world. The alchemists are there now. Working on a cure for the petrification disease. Dare we hope? In my experience, they always have an ulterior motive. Remember to be on your guard when you're with them. Yeah, didn't they cause the petrification disease somehow? Um, at least some... I think we read some things that suggested they might have Barren Swamp. Barren Swamp was originally vacant useless land it became a massive dumping ground when the factory started disposing of puppets the polluted groundwater spawned strange creatures hmm. perhaps similar to the ones in the cathedral definitely worth an investigation and rumors whisper a rare treasure in a monster's nest treasure you say why don't you go look for it son 
Don't have to ask me twice. Central Station. Yes, it's where you woke up. Why was I there? There used to be a workshop near the station. However, the puppets destroyed it when they attacked. Many of the puppets have moved on, but now strange monsters lurk nearby. Be careful if you go back. You're precious to me. Okay, so we might see fewer puppets if we re-explore already explored areas, but there might be uh, strange monsters to replace them. Alchemist headquarters. People call them the Alchemists of the Isle. Their headquarters must be on an island across the sea, but it's not on any charts. I remember tales of an underground dock in Krat where the alchemists would embark. That's all I know. All right, let's look at the painting. Oh, uh... Yeah, there's something growing... Off of it. Um, I, that's weird. I never lied this uh, for this playthrough. I'm only doing uh, telling the truth. So that's very strange. Hmm. Well, let's just uh, just ignore that for now. Um. Yeah, it's it's a nose, and it's getting longer. Uh. So we gotta find this um, this guy that was at the front desk. He said to meet him out in the courtyard at somewhere or something. We're gonna find him, but I gotta do that next time. So we're gonna end the episode here, find that guy, and then I gotta give him something so he'll sell more items. And then um, we can continue on the second part of the game, I assume, which is find the alchemist, find out what they're up to and find a cure for the petrification disease. Alright, thank you for watching, and I'll see you soon.